pound US dollar trading up into that full 50% short. Uh, in the near term here, there's an equal eggs up off the lows that is running into some short term resistance uh, right here as we speak. Stops would be above the 145.50s, first targets to the 145.15s. This little micro could take us lower here. Nothing wrong with selling that little, this little first target to get free. If you get stopped out, the better sells up towards the 146. Pound US dollar, again, little micro three waves up into equal legs here from the 145.30s. Uh, we're able to sell it here, try to get free to the 145. 15 stops above the 145, 55, 145, 60 area. If we get above there, Look for a larger three-wave structure up towards the 146s. Stops above a 146.50. First targets to the 145.70. All for swings down towards the 143.60. Pound, pound US dollar, beautiful three waves up into that uh, equal X. It's getting free into first targets now, so be sure to uh, be sure to get your first targets filled as the 76.4 line off of that uh, spike rally into equal eggs. Um, now gets free. So this is exactly what I'm talking about when I mentioned that the NFP or news events like this are just accelerants into inflection zones. Today, it happened to be an accelerant into the equal exit inflection zone short for the pound US dollar.